here we go. Oh my god. <gasps> hey you guys, it's the Gaming Mermaid and welcome to my channel. So welcome to another episode of The Sims 4 Monster High vs Ever After High. So as you can see in the last episode, Dracula got married to Claude Wolf. So we are here in the restaurant. This is Claudine's restaurant. Uh, there's a big mess here. I got a lot of suggestions about uh, changing Claudine her store because a lot of people wanted her to have her own clothing store. So I think that what we're going to do with this uh, restaurant is we're going to actually change it to Venus's restaurant. And I got a comment saying that the restaurant should be vegan or vegetarian or what have you and just be really, really conscious about the environment and things like that. And I think that would be a really awesome idea. What in the world is Laguna doing here? She does like water, so I mean, that does make sense. Let me go ahead and check on everyone. Okay, everybody is sleeping, and where is Claude? He's over, he's just randomly sitting here. He's standing here. He has been here since they got married, and he has not moved out of that spot. I am not sure why, but anyway, I think we're going to make this Venus's restaurant. So I need to check on how I can do that. And then we're going to make another store for Claudine so she can have her own clothing store. So we are gonna go ahead and edit the restaurant menu. We're gonna make it vegetarian, I think. Let's get rid of the clam chowder. I think all of that is fine. Let's go over here, mac and cheese. That's vegetarian, that's not vegan. Hot dogs are obviously not vegan. Veggie burgers, we can get rid of the sausage. BLT, hamburgers, fish, uh, grilled chicken, meatballs. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and just make this vegetarian. And I'm just gonna go ahead and pretend that all of the desserts are vegan. So we're just gonna go with that now. Should we do some advertising? I think that might help um, Not yet just not not just yet, but we can go ahead and do that Let me go back over to Claudine So we're gonna go over here and we're gonna go here and then buy a retail store So let's go ahead and do that and of course we're gonna make it in Windenburg Let's see where should it be the restaurant is over here So I think we're gonna put it in here in this little lot over here. So it's right next door, right? So what do we need to get we need to get a cash register. Oh, transfer funds to your business. We just need a cash register. So let's see, where can we put that? I think I'm just going to go ahead and change this whole lot altogether. Oh my goodness, this person has the same name as me. That is so cool. Oh, this looks super awesome too. Oh, it looks super like retro looking. That is really cool. But we're looking for a clothing store. Let me, oh, this looks cute. Pink candy bakery. We need like a clothing store. That is so cute. Look at this one. Oh my goodness. This is like a Barbie store. Oh, here we go. Clothing store. That is helpful. <laughs> All right. Let's just go ahead and go with this one. Go. So this is going to be Claudine's new clothing store. Now, I don't know what to call it. So if you guys have any name suggestions for Claudine's clothing store and Venus's new restaurant, let me know in the comments down below. What should it be called? Like Claudine's boutique or I don't, I don't know. <laughs> let me know your thoughts in the comments down below so obviously we're going to be selling clothing but um if you have any other suggestions let me know as well what else should claudine sell and also let me know what type of clothing store should she have should it be like super fancy or should it be like casual or whatever let's go ahead and design these uniforms i don't know if i want to design it because i just like to have fun but apparently nobody else likes to so i guess i'm just gonna leave it the way it is so that i don't get any complaints about their uniforms all right so let's go ahead and manage the employees let's see <gasps> we can hire we can hire raven <gasps> Oh my gosh. Let's go ahead and hire Raven. She's 24 simoleons an hour. Oh my gosh, everybody else is like 40 simoleons an hour. We just hired Raven Queen <laughs> to be our employee. And what is this? We can promote her or demote her or fire her. Oh my goodness. Wow. We could have Sleeping Beauty as our employee as well. Oh my goodness. Now let's see. She's good at maintenance. She's not as good at sales or work ethic. Actually, Raven Queen doesn't have any work ethic or anything. So maybe we should get somebody that is better at sales, I think. I think we should hire uh, Spike here because then he'll be like really good at making sales. Let's fire Raven. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> because I wanna I wanna hire somebody that is a little bit better. She's gonna like show up and then she's gonna be instantly fired. I'm sorry. Oh gosh. Okay. Let's go back. Let's manage the employees. Let's get a good employee so that somebody that's good at sales. So I think that he'll be good at sales. He's good at work ethic too. Not so good at maintenance. But I think I think he's a good overall kind of guy. And we really need sales, especially when starting out. Let's just hire Spike. Yeah, we'll do that. We're gonna go ahead and open the store 
and he can go ahead and work on all of that. Oh, Raven's angry. Oh my goodness. We're opening our store at 11 o'clock at night. <laughs> I just want to see what he looks like. Is this him? <gasps> there he goes. He wants cake. Well, you might have cake once you make all those sales, Spike. So go ahead and get started while I'm playing on my phone. I wonder if anybody's even going to come over here. Oh my gosh, people are actually coming to our store. Wow. Let's see, another guy is coming. Oh, it seems that only guys are coming over to the clothing store. That is really interesting. I didn't know that we were selling only men's clothes, but apparently that's a thing. All right, so let's go over here and uh, take a look. See, I, so he's talking to him. Let's greet this customer. Let's greet the other customer. Oh, he seems to really like that outfit. He tried it on and all this. Well, is he just leaving? Did you just, oh, and we have a woman right here who is pregnant. <laughs> so let's go ahead and see. <gasps> She's trying on the outfit, that is so cool. Let's greet her. Let's just be really nice to everybody. I wonder if Spike is gonna go ahead and do some stuff. Let's assign some work tasks. So why don't you go ahead and ring up some customers? All right, let's take a look, see. I don't think we greeted him, so let's go ahead and greet that customer, and then we'll greet him as well. I feel like I'm the security. I'm like on watch, see what everybody is doing. I don't know if anybody else is like interested in buying or if they're just here. Manage Spike, what does that mean? Oh, we can promote him, praise him, demotes, check up. Oh, interesting. Let's go ahead and praise him. Oh, what choice, what value? I'm ready to buy. Okay, so he is ready to buy. Let's go ahead and ring him up because apparently our employee uh, is not doing that. Let me see, maybe we should, oh, Spike is already doing this. Okay, apparently he's already doing that. I don't see him doing that but I guess so. All right, here we go. I don't know why Spike isn't doing this, but she has her little iPad going on and she's gonna take his order, so that is cool. Looks like he doesn't seem to like it. All right, let's take a look. See, this guy is like halfway to making a decision. I wonder if we should ask about price range. That's kind of tacky. Let's just try to be friendly, ask about his day. Why don't we have him do something? Because apparently he's not doing anything. I don't know if he's actually... Why don't you answer customer's questions? He's ready to buy again? Didn't we just ring him up? I wanna take a look, see what this iPad looks like. Oh, look at that. Oh, look, it's on Google. She's on Sim Google. She's putting his credit card information. Oh, she's trying to hide it from me. Can't hide from me. I see everything, Claudine. Putting her password. All right, cool. Oh, it looks like somebody else is ready to be rung up. So let's go ahead and ring him up because apparently our employee is not doing anything. He's just talking, shooting the breeze. And every time I try to do this, it says he's already doing it, but he's clearly not. So I don't know what's going on with that. Hopefully this guy doesn't get frustrated. He's like, I've been waiting here for like 10 minutes now and I'm still not rung up. I don't know what's happening. Okay, here we go. So now Claudia, he's gonna be close. Oh my gosh. Bob Pancakes is like buying up our entire store. He's literally said that like five times now. Oh my goodness, he is so close too. Spike, please do something. Is he gonna do something? Oh wow, look, he, he bought the outfit. That is so cool. For 218 simoleons, somebody's made of money. Oh gosh, now there's everybody Everybody is waiting and this guy still hasn't even <gasps> oh no Bob pancakes why 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 spike why spike spike please spike what are you doing everybody is oh my god are you actually gonna do something thank goodness he's actually doing something everybody else has been waiting <gasps> he left Bob pancakes I'm sorry I'm so sorry my employee's horrible. All right, let's ring him up as well. He's been waiting here for a little while. All right, she bought that outfit. Oh, we're gonna have to start restocking. Oh, wow, everybody is looking super fancy now. Look at him, looking all fancy. All right, we need to go ahead and restock all of this. So let's see, Um, restock outfits, dress mannequin, create outfit. Let's just restock it. Let's just do that. Now we can put, we, now we can put different stuff here for sale. So like, for example, we can set this for sale. We can set like these books for sale. So we can set pretty much anything for sale. So if you guys have any ideas, like we can sell this perfume. So if you have any ideas for like other stuff you'd like for me to sell, feel free to let me know in the comments down below. All right, so I think she is restocking, She's writing some notes down, pretty much set everything on sale. So hopefully that will work. Let's just set that for sale, we don't need that. All right, and it looks like he's actually doing some work, so I think we're good to go. I think we can leave him here by himself. I'm just waiting for Claudine to actually restock everything. Finally, that took her five hours. So when she's done restocking this, then we're just gonna go ahead and go home. Spike can stay here for the rest of his life <laughs> working. Um, okay, so we are good. Everybody is looking fancy. 
Let me see if somebody is waiting. Oh, looks like Ariel is waiting to be rung up. So let's go ahead and ring her up. We need to ring him up as well. We need some more employees here. So that's a thing. Looks like somebody bought some of the perfume. That's cool. Alrighty, so she bought that. Let's go ahead and restock this. And then once she's done with that, let's go ahead and check the financial reports. Let's see, let's view the shift summary. Alright, so we made a net profit of $3.99. So that is cool. I'm just gonna let Claudine go home now. She needs to take care of herself anyway. So Spike can have fun with this. We're gonna go back home. We need to check up on Fang because I definitely want to age him up in this part. I have a lot of the Ever After High characters in this little house right here just to have them there um so yeah let's go back home all right so our net profit was 359 so a little bit less than we had before it looks like fang has returned from daycare so that is great oh i accidentally brought apple here whoops all right so poor claudine let me have her use the bathroom um then she can take a shower she can go ahead and do that uh how is laguna doing she's doing just fine she's gonna talk to frankie stein it looks like they're gonna hug she's gonna watch a funny video that is great so let me go ahead and go to draculaura let's do a little something romantic maybe oh look they did that on their own free will let's try to do something a little romantic with claude oh my goodness i did not even see that so you guys were right the medicine was on the floor this whole time I, th I thought i put it in his pocket i really thought i put that in gil's pocket but apparently i didn't so i guess he just got better the natural way so i guess that works why is why is uh venus so flirty she's gonna go in bed what is she doing watch a romantic comedy wow she is like watching a little too many of those romantic comedies so if you guys have a suggestion for a little bit of love life for venus let me know in the comments down below let's check up on claudine she's taking a shower so then she needs to do something for fun what is she gonna do watch some tv and then she can go ahead and eat something and then go to sleep let's check up on little fang here so i think what we're gonna do is have him actually i think what we should do is have him have his own room so let me go over here to the build mode let's move him over we're gonna move him over here like this hold on let me just get this out of the way we're gonna put him right there and then we'll put this little trash can right there so once he ages up then he can have that as his room it looks pretty much like a little boy's room <laughs> already and then this will be Floyd and Draculaura's room here I'm gonna go ahead and uh, check on the locks so let's see we're gonna have this lock door for everyone but Claudine no can we do this as no we can't do this as Fang just yet but let me see if we can lock the door for everyone but Draculaura everyone but household members um, this might be a little confusing. I can't lock the door for everyone except for two characters. So, uh-oh. Looks like Fang is crying. Oh no. It looks like he needs to change his diaper. Let's change his dirty diaper. That, oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, so there we go. Now he's happy. Look at him. Let's go ahead and feed him. And then we can just talk to him. How adorable. All right, and where did Claude go? Claude, no, stop going on the computer. Stop playing Blick Block. You have to be a father. So let me go ahead and have him talk to little Fang before we age him up. Let's make a silly face and just be really silly. He's so cute, oh my goodness. All right guys, so moment of truth. We are gonna go ahead and have Draculaura come over here. Where is she? We're gonna have Draculaura come over here because this is a big deal. We need them both up here. Let me make sure I'm over here with Claude and we're gonna have him age, no, 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 no. This is not the time to be eating. Claude, come back over here. And where is Draculaura? She is taking a little too long to come upstairs, please. Please hurry. All right, we're both here now. Now, let's go ahead and age up Fang. Oh no, no, stop. <laughs> no, stop eating, no. Draculaura, you're gonna come over here. Frankie, please go away. Thank you. All right, now, we're gonna pause this. <laughs> now let's go over here. We're gonna age up Fang. Let me just take a look at little baby Fang before we age him up. Look at his adorableness, all right? Because we don't know how he's gonna age up. So here he is. Just take a good look at him. Just look at him. All right, look at, look at those gorgeous eyes. Okay, so now we're gonna do this. We are going to do this. And I do not want you guys to mess this up. Okay, Frankie? All right, so we're gonna do this right now. We are gonna go and age up Fang. Okay, so here we go. Here it is. All right, here we go. Oh my god! Look at him! Look at him! 
Oh my god! Fang aged up childhood, boundless creativity, rule breaking, and temper tantrums. Oh wait, we have to pick an aspiration. What kind of what kind of uh, child would Fang be? His parents are Draculaura and Claude Wolf, so. Hmm, this is interesting. I'm not sure what to pick. I'm gonna pick social butterfly. Hmm, let's just make him cheerful. I don't know. Um, we could always change it later. Okay, so let's take a look at Fang. He has black hair, just like Draculaura. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at him. He has brown eyes. He has like brownish, yellowish eyes, just like Claude. How adorable. He has no eyebrows though. <laughs> that is a problem. But oh my goodness, we're gonna go ahead and change him up. We're gonna change up his look a little bit. Why is Claudine getting a phone call? Oh hey, we haven't gathered in quite a while. Perhaps we should all meet. Um, not right now. I need to check up on Fang right now. We're gonna change him up. We're gonna change up his look. Let's change his outfit. Let's go ahead and plan outfits. We are gonna give him a little mini makeover. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, here he is. Oh wow, look at him. Oh, he has like mini... Do you see that? It's like a little bit pointed, like mini elf ears. Very cool. Wow. Let's, uh, you know, this might be cheating, but let's just give him some eyebrows. I think that would be a good idea so that he looks a little bit normal. You know, I don't want to go too crazy, but let's see. I like these. Let's make them black, just like his hair. Yeah, his eyes are really similar to Claude's. Look at his little luscious lips, <laughs> just like Jackie Laura. Look at her lips. Take a look-see. So here's Draculaura's lips. Here is Fang. He has like a nose similar to Claude's, I see. Wow, look how cute. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and give him a little bit of a makeover with his outfit just so that he looks a little cooler. I don't know. So once I'm done with this, I will be right back with you guys. So I wanna check out his other outfits just on his own. So let's check out his formal wear. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my God, you look so cute. Let's go ahead and check out his athletic wear. Okay, very cool. Let's check out his sleepwear. Oh my goodness, look at those pants. Wow. Let's check out his party wear. Ooh, he looks like a little, little rebel, like little moto bike biker rebel. <laughs> very cute. And let's check out his swimwear. Okay, very basic, but that is cool. I'm kind of liking this shirt. Ooh, I like that. Check out the different, ooh, I like that. Okay, we're gonna give that to him. All right, so here he goes. I'm just gonna give him this outfit. I don't know. Let's just go with it. Let's hear his voice as well. All right, he has a very cute voice. And the cool thing about this is now that he's a kid we can follow him to school and then we can meet some new people and see what happens I think that is exciting and then also getting the other characters to have children so that'll be really cool so here is little Fang I see that his skin tone is very similar to Draculaura's but it's a little just a little slightly tan just a, a little hint of tan from Claude which I think is really cool so there's Fang Let's go ahead and have him talk to his parents. <laughs> that would be great. Let's have Claude over here, come over here. Let's have Claude come over here and express love. Yes, yes, Claude, you need to do that. Please do. Please show your love to this little child that you created yourself with Draculaura. Oh, oh my gosh. That is so cute. How adorable is that? Let me have Draculaura come over here as well. Draculaura, where are you going? No, you're not. Come over here and express your love to your new son. Let's become best friends with Bang. Yes, look how adorable this is. This is just too cute. This is too cute for words. Oh, look how cute. This is so cute. This is a good, happy ending. I think I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. Here is Bang as a child. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you would like to see next. Look how cute. Oh my god, I'm just so happy. They're like a cute little happy family. Um, would you like for me to have them move out into their own house and have their own little family uh, story going on on their own? Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Thank you guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.